Hey, Big Cat Homestead fam. Today I'm going to give you an update on the baby turkeys. And I'll see if I can bring Lone Star out here. The baby turkeys are about four and a half weeks. And Lone Star is three weeks. So we'll see um, if they're going to cooperate today. All right. I'll be right back. Don't fly. There's a nose. Pretty big. Here's Cheek. There they are. <laughs> Look how big they are. <laughs> they may fly away. Sometimes they'll let you pet them. Y'all gonna face the camera? Nose might show out and do some strutting for y'all. I don't know. We'll leave the camera on and see what they do. <laughs> Let me see if I can get Lone Star. So y'all can see the difference in the size. This one is Cheek, right here, and that's Nose. Look at the size difference. I know one is definitely a boy. This one has been Tom in it, but this one strutted a little bit too. But look at the different sizes. And wait till you see Lone Star. Lone Star is not happy. Here we go. There's Lone Star. See the difference? That's a three week difference in size. Look at them. They're just getting to know each other. I think Lone Star may be a girl. Because look at her tail, how long it is. And then nose. A little bit shorter. So I'm, for, some, for some reason, I think these two are boys. Definitely this one, because that one's Tom in it. But Lone Star hasn't made a single sound like these little ones. And Lone Star hasn't gobbled. And these are four weeks old. And Nose is already gobbling. Look at them. I'm going to combine them in the same kennel this week. I've been putting them next to the chickens in Lone Star so they can see them and smell them and hear them. So it's not like they're new. Alright, Big at Home said fam, that was the turkey reunion. I hope you enjoyed it. Those of you that have turkeys, let me know about your experience. Um, they do have a mild demeanor. They're much cleaner than the chickens, but they do get along with the chickens. Um, and also, they're a little bit fragile. Like, they act big and bad, but when you go to get them, they're more... Um, more fragile i'll say than the chickens um i have been giving them probiotic water and electrolyte water since i've had them i'm going to continue to do that because um they seem to be healthy and i only lost that one turkey the first day and they said that could have been something with the hatchery so um they look good and i'm going to be reuniting well, not really now. I'm going to be incorporating the, the smaller turkeys in with the bigger turkey and the chickens. And they've been next to each other. They hear each other. They see each other. They just weren't able to touch each other. Um, so I think it's going to be fine. The chickens are four weeks ahead. The bigger turkey is three weeks ahead. Um, and as you see, they seem to get along. And actually, when I turned the camera off, they were copying what Lone Star was doing. When Lone Star flew, they flew. Lone Star look around, they look around. 
So I think it's good um, if you do have turkeys to get more than one so they have their turkey buddies and their turkey instincts. Um, if not, they might start acting like a chicken. <laughs> so, um, yeah, um, that's all I have for today. Uh, if you enjoyed the content, go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, share, and follow. Thank you for watching. Bye. Okay, we just redid their bedding. And next we're going to put the crate over them in their... There they go. Look at the babies. <laughs> and then we're going to put the perches in and then the turkey babies. This is the first time we're putting the turkey babies in with the other turkey and the chickens. And as you'll see, the male baby turkey challenged everyone and they chased them all around this uh, chicken coop. So um, Lone Star came to their rescue and kind of stuck beside them, but I ended up thinking that it was just a little too soon. Cheek was like, I'm not gonna have no parts to this. Cheek was hiding around the corner. He was like, I don't need these kind of problems. And here's Cheek coming out of hiding, and now Nose is in hiding right there in the corner back there. Okay, we're nearing the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed the content, and I did end up removing the baby turkeys. I just felt that they need to be a little bit bigger before I introduce them. Thank you for watching. Bye.